loves thanks for watching and welcome back i hope everyone is doing well today so getting into the video i am using betty cora's 3xl straight square tips and this beautiful purple is called ivy lagoon and it is from the tropical shores collection from kairos nail supplies and i'm also using bomb nails size 14 kalinsky brush and all of that is linked in the description for you guys the website for kairos nail supplies and my coupon code along with Paige's coupon code for Bomb Nails and Melody Susie. And now I'm just taking the Ivy Lagoon and I want this nail to be as thin as it can be so I'm just trying to paint it on. And now I'm just doing the same thing with this nail. You want to take smaller, wetter beads and you just want to kind of paint it on the nail. And where these acrylics are so pigmented, it makes it really easy to be able to do that. Now I'm taking this beautiful color, it's called Vanilla Almond, and it is from their Bear With Me collection. It is 
a beautiful collection. All of the colors are so beautiful and buttery. And they're still having their sale as of right now. So if you guys haven't checked it out, I'm not sure how much longer they're going to have it. But you guys are really missing out. It is a huge sale. And all of their products are really amazing. So you're getting a really good deal. So now I'm tempting a Frenchie on this finger. My Frenchies were really whack on this set. So when you can still move the acrylic, I take like a um, cuticle pusher and I will kind of clear it out a little bit better because if it's really thin, sometimes it's hard for the file to get it. So I will just take the end of the cuticle pusher and I will push it up so it's easier to file. And now I'm tempting another Frenchie on this finger and I will let you guys just watch me kind of struggle with it. At the same time, you can see how buttery and easy to work with this acrylic is. It really does give you a lot of time to be able to move it where you want it. And now I'm taking that beautiful Ivy Lagoon from the Tropical Shores collection and I'm using my Pana. It's my size 5 brush. It's just a little bit bigger than the size 4 and I'm just going to use it to push this purple up in the smile lines.
And then once you've got it in the smile lines, you can take the bigger brush and just kind of smooth everything out and then get the design to where you want it. And now I'm just doing the same thing on this side. And now I'm just taking this glitter. One really wasn't the color, so I just kind of dip into both of them. And you don't really need a whole lot, so I just dipped a little bit. And then I'm just taking it up to where that line ends. I almost forgot to mention that I got this nail inspo from Vanessa Nails. She does beautiful work, so you guys have to go check her out. So now I just crinkled up this foil a little bit, and these are the foils that I got from Timu. And I'm not sure why I tried to use hard gel on the pinky, and then I had realized that I need the Born Pretty Transfer Gel. So that's what I'm putting on the first finger. You just want to put a good amount of the transfer gel and then make sure that you cure it for over two minutes. And this nail I really didn't have a problem with, but where I tried hard gel on the pinky, it gave me a little bit more trouble. Now I'm going to take my scissors and I'm just going to cut around the nail. So now I'm taking a hand file and it's okay to leave it a little bit longer on the sides because I feel like when you file it into the nail, it kind of blends it in more with the tip.
And now I'm going to encaps all of the nails in clear acrylic and I will just let you guys watch that.
And now I'm gonna file all of the nails and I'm using my same Melody Susie M Series nail drill. And I do have that linked in the description for you guys along with Paige's discount code and the link for the dust collector and the hand rest. This has been a really good dust collector. It is rechargeable and it comes with an extra filter. And so far I haven't had any problems with it. It works really good. So if you guys are looking for one, it is linked in the description for you guys. And now I'm just going to go through and hand file all of the nails, make sure there's nothing on the sides and to make sure the tip is straight. And now we're going to top coat all of the nails and I'm using Savvy Land's top coat.
I added some gym gel and now I'm just adding some rhinestones and I'm just going biggest to smallest down the Frenchies. And now I'm just adding some caviar beads in between. And that's pretty much well it for today's video. So I want to thank everybody for watching. If you haven't hit that like and subscribe yet, please do. I hope everybody has a great day. Bye.